In the end, it turned into a no-confidence motion against Mamta Banerjee, a massive loss of face for the West Bengal Chief Minister. Joining us now is Senior Leader of the Trinamool Congress, Sugat Rai. Thank you very much, Mr. Rai, for joining us on Centre Stage this evening. This is a big embarrassment, sir, for the Trinamool Congress and personally for Mamta Banerjee, except for the four BJD members. Nobody supported your no-confidence motion, a massive loss of face for the Trinamool Congress. I think you are making it sound too hyperbolic and dramatic. There is no loss of face. The Rumul Congress has once again shown its commitment to the people of India. When he took the decision to move the no confidence motion in our meeting on 17th November, we knew that we had only 19 members in parliament. We had hoped that those people were vociferous in opposing the government on corruption and on FDI in retail would come forward to support the motion. They are now offering excuses as to why they did not support the motion. I think we have made our point. Many people were saying that we won't be able to move the motion. It was because of their ignorance of the rules of parliament. People thought that we needed... What exactly is the point that we Mamta Khan has been able please, to make, please. Mr. Roy? You know, this turned out in the end the into, point, a, the into point, a no confidence the point, motion no, I think against Mamta Banerjee. Please, please, what's please, the point please you've made? no, no, you are always hyperbolic. You are always hyperbolic, exaggerating and attacking to Mamta Banerjee. It's not fair. All I wanted to say that we wanted to make a point that we are opposing the government. We wanted to show that we are wholesale against the government. We are opposing the government and wanting to go lock, stock and barrel. We have made that point that other parties who say they are actually opposing the government did not have the gumption, the guts to stand up and support us. Maybe they thought that why would Trinamool Congress steal the thunder from us? Whoever has done whatever has lying exposed before the people of the country. No. Our no confidence motion did not have the leave of the house. That does not mean it has been rejected by the people of the country. The people of the country are actually rejecting the government for its anti-people policy. Now, what's the so message no that's going out to our viewers that tonight? Mamta the message that's that going out to our viewers tonight. Dramatic. It has no meaning. The message that's going out to what? our viewers tonight is that Mamta Banerjee might be a competent street fighter. She's a bad political strategist. She suffered a loss of face in the presidential elections when her when her gamble boomeranged and now once again, with the no-confidence motion, the Congress outfoxing, outmaneuvering, outthinking Mamta Banerjee. Your choice of words are unnecessarily dramatic and as I said, hyperbolic. The Con Mamta Banerjee has not been outfoxed. She plays the game straight, in the straight and narrow path. She does not indulge in backroom maneuvers. She appealed to everybody openly that please support the no confidence motion if you are really opposed to the government at the center. If you are really opposed to FDI in multi brand retail, then support our no confidence motion. She even went to the extent of saying that the, if the left were to move a no confidence motion, let them have the upper hand, we would support it. What else could she do? Indian politics is such that people say one thing and do another thing. There has been no loss of face. Mamta Banerjee has not been out Fox. Mamta Banerjee has been forthright. Her party has taken a decision in parliament. We have put it on record on the floor of the parliament that we wanted to move a confidence no, motion. So now what happens moved it when the BJP been... moves for a discussion on FDI? You know, will Mamta Banerjee support that? Mamta Banerjee spoke so often to Sushma Swaraj herself. Despite that, the BJP didn't come around. Why do you think the BJP betrayed you? Mamta, who told you that the Mamta Banerjee spoke to Sushma Swaraj? Murli Manohar Joshi made a public statement. Wrong information. I don't... Murli Manohar Joshi... Dr. Joshi is a respected man, but age is catching up with him. He did not have the facts correct. Mamta Banerjee did not spoke to Mrs. Sushma Sharma. You are accusing Dr. Joshi of lying. You are no, accusing him no, of lying? Dr. 
Doctor, misleading again, the public. Again, you are using hyperbolic words. Again, you are using hyperbolic words. Let Dr. Joshi come to your channel and say on what basis she said that Mamta Banerjee spoke to Shushma Sharaj. Mamta Banerjee spoke to nobody. Our party leaders have spoken to people in the other parties, but Mamta Banerjee did not speak that. Dr. Joshi went to Calcutta. So she thought, he thought that he should say something to the press and he said that. We have never said that we have spoken to... No, so what Shushma happens Shushma now energy has spoken to Shushma Shah. when the BJP wa what and happens? the left want a discussion on FDI in retail under a rule that allows voting, will the Trinamool support it or are, is Mamta so slighted now that she won't support this either? No, no. Any vote against the government will support. It's not a question of who's moving the thing. In parliament, we will oppose the government wholesale. But if, if they let the BJP get an agreement from the government to move Rule 8, 184, the government is not wanting a discussion under Rule 184. Let us see what the BJP does about that. If the government does not agree, what the chance was, today's no confidence motion, when we could have spoken and voted against the government on this FDI issue, 184 is still not clear. And why should we try to add to BJP's numbers? If there is voting, ultimately, we'll move against FDA. We'll vote no, but against why didn't FDI. You, why didn't you work nothing. in tandem with the BJP and the left in the first place? You know, Mamta Banerjee clearly wants to take an extreme position, get everybody to dance to her tunes, which is possible when, you know, the UPA government Again, is dependent on her, but not Again, otherwise. You are using no, but the fact, those are the facts, sir. Words. No, no, I'm hyperbolic words that you're using words. again and again. I'm only laying out the facts. You yes, know, she's David, but she thinks she's Goliath, and the comment time 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 shows her her place. And using big bombastic words. If you don't like hyperbole, I, I, I say you are using bombastic words useless, meaningless, bombastic. No, here's the point Mamata I'm Banerjee making, sir. Nobody. That Mamta Banerjee, as a David with her 19 Banerjee MPs, wants, thinks she's Goliath. And each time, Congress shows how small her party is and how few MPs she has. Okay? No, no. Mamta Banerjee, why? Even one member, one member party can move a no-confidence motion. It's for the other parties to decide whether they will support it or not. So there is no question of working in tandem with anybody. She gave a, since this is a cause which affects the people of India, she gave a general call. She had hope, we had hope that other parties who are so vociferous in their opposition to the government would come forward. They did not come forward. The people will judge them for what they are. I have one final Whatever. question for you, Sugotarai, yes. before I let you go. Yes. Do you think Mamta yes. Banerjee is losing yes. credibility? The fact that she, you know, she spoke about a war cry to topple the UPA regime. In the end, it's Mamta Banerjee uh, who's ended up being the loser, the UPA being the winner. Do you think this is impacting now her credibility at the national stage? She makes big claims which she can't deliver on. Absolute Mamta Banerjee never said, never claimed that she would pull down the government. She said that we should pull down the government. We should throw out the government because it is adopting anti-people policies. It is for the other parties in the we are a party mainly restricted to West Bengal. We have enough realism to understand that by ourselves we cannot overthrow the government. But we had hoped that other people who say okay. that they are bigger parties, they are all India parties, they would come forward, but they have shown themselves to be giants with clay feet. They did not have the gumption to stand up you and support the no-confidence motion. Okay which could have brought the government down to its knees. You've had your say. I don't want to sit in on judgment. We let our viewers decide whether Mamta has, you know, furthered her credibility or has it been diminished. Mr. Sugotarai, for joining us. I do not agree with you at all. Let our viewers decide. Let our viewers decide. It's not about only agreeing honest, with me or not. Only honest politician. In, in, in any country. democracy, it's the voter who decides. He's the one who makes the ultimate call. Thank you very much, Mr. Sugodharai, for joining us on Center Stage this evening.